Welcome friends. Today I'm sharing a weekly grocery haul that's mostly fresh items and things that I needed to complete meals uh, from stuff I already had in my fridge and pantry. And of course, you know, the random basket of unfolded laundry in the corner, pay it no mind. All right, if you're new here, hi, my name is Meredith. I do all kinds of hauls and unboxings here on my channel, the occasional cooking video and whatever the heck else I feel like. So if that sounds like a good time, hit the red subscribe button down below and we can hang out more often. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and let's do it. So first off on the meal plan is chicken taco bowls. That's actually what we're having tonight. So I needed some of the ingredients on this table to complete that meal. Most of the stuff I had on hand, but I did need some shredded lettuce and some sour cream to top off those taco bowls to use up the shredded chicken that's in my crock pot right now, which I have shared that recipe before, so I'll try to remember to put that video in the description box for you guys to check out. We're gonna do chicken nachos um, this week on family movie night instead of pizza. I know, we're going crazy. So that's how we're gonna use up that shredded chicken. It's gonna be super yummy and a fun dinner. We're also gonna try out sushi bowls with shrimp. So I have some jasmine rice already in my pantry and I have some fresh veggies that we're gonna put in this and some shrimp in my freezer that I wanna get used up. So we'll do that. Uh, we're gonna have grilled cheeseburgers, pizza night of course. Um, I have some turkey, um, you know, marinara sauce with ground turkey that's already been cooked. So I have some leftover in the freezer. We're gonna use some spaghetti to use that up. And one of my kids requested chicken and dumplings. I was actually kind of like not inspired by the meal planning this week. So the chicken nachos was actually one of my boys idea and the chicken and dumplings was the other ones. So anyways, let's do this grocery haul. Okay, so first up we have a can of evaporated milk. This goes in the sauce for the chicken and dumplings. I grabbed some bananas just to have fresh fruit on hand. The cucumbers are for both snacking, sides for meals, and they're also going to go uh, in those sushi bowls. So I will peel them, seed them, and cut them up in chunks for the sushi bowls. It should be super yummy, refreshing, especially on a hot summer day. Grabbed some strawberries just, again, for a snacking um, and to have fresh fruit with meals. My kids can eat that whole box in one sitting, so it won't last long. I did grab some of the Outshine Fruit Bars. Lemon is my husband's favorite flavor, so I picked that up. We have some petite carrots, so we're gonna use these just for snacking, and then I'm also going to use them in the chicken and dumplings, because that does call for some um, carrots. I'm just gonna cut these ones up. And then I'm also going to use a peeler to peel off ribbons of carrot for the sushi bowls. We have some organic American cheese. This is to top our cheeseburgers with and also one of my children loves grilled cheese sandwiches and this is his preferred cheese type for that. Grabbed an onion, so I'll probably saute some of this up with some bell pepper that I have in my fridge to go in our uh, taco bowls tonight or you could call them burrito bowls, I suppose. And then the rest of the onion is going to go in the chicken and dumplings. Grab some Roma tomatoes. Those are gonna go on top of our burgers. Um, I might chop one up to put on top of our burrito bowls tonight. And some might just be sliced for sandwiches. I grabbed the Terry Ho's Yum Yum Sauce, the original, just regular flavor, and then the spicy one, because I know my husband's gonna want a little extra spice for his sushi bowl, so. And I might try the spicy one too. That just sounds, I love a good kick to my sushi. And when I say sushi, I usually eat California rolls, so I'm not like hardcore or anything. All right, grabbed a gallon of milk to drink and cook with. This was just speaking to me. It looked tasty. This is the Philadelphia Cheesecake Packs. So these ones are the cherry flavored, but I believe they also had a strawberry one, but don't quote me on that. All right, so I grabbed two things of coffee creamer. I didn't realize when I was... Uh, adding these to my cart that I had grabbed the smaller size. So there's that. I'll have to get that again soon. Um, I grabbed one pizza. This is the DiGiorno for cheese. I had gotten various pizzas in my last Costco haul and we have used up the cheese pizzas but not the pepperoni pizzas. So there is an imbalance of pizza in my freezer. It just can't work. And so since two of my children will only eat cheese pizza, I picked that up. I did go ahead and get some celery, it was upside down. So we got some celery. This is also for 
the chicken and dumplings and I'm gonna need to chop up the rest because most of my family does not eat celery just plain or dipping so I will freeze it and throw it in soups coming in the fall. I grabbed two things of plain high V bagels. Um, we have bagel sandwiches on the menu as well. That's more of a lunch item. I grabbed the two pack of Philadelphia cream cheese to go with the bagels. Here is the shredded lettuce that I needed for our burrito bowls and to throw on top of our nachos tomorrow. We grabbed a pound of the uh, Applewood smoked chicken breast from Deluso. Uh, looks like they gave me a little more um, and then a pound, I'm reading the label here, getting distracted. But anyways, this is going to go on just regular sandwiches, our bagel sandwiches. Um, so hopefully the kids will eat that. I needed some organic pumpkin to put in soap. I know that sounds kind of crazy, but it gives the soap a really lovely texture. Um, so, and I'm making my fall soaps coming up. So one of these cans, well, half of one of these cans will end up in bars of soap and the rest of it will end up in pumpkin pie later on. So I'll probably have to freeze some of it. I did go ahead and get some chicken broth. I needed two of these to go in my chicken and dumplings, but then I also grabbed two for our pantry. I like to keep chicken stock on hand because I actually do cook with it quite a bit. So it's nice to have one in the pantry ready to go when I need it. I grabbed, <laughs> I always say grabbed. Um, I got a <laughs> container of cottage cheese just for snacking. My husband, myself, and our daughter really likes that. Sour cream to go on top of the bowls. And then I also grabbed more popsicles because it's hot, it's summer, and the kids are always asking for a popsicle as a treat. All right, so that is everything that I got from Hy-Vee this week. Let me know if you have any fun new recipes or meal ideas that you've been going to a lot. I'm always looking for meal inspiration and hopefully my meal plan gave you some as well. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the bell. You guys know I'll be talking to you soon. Bye-bye.